Everybody wants fast internet around the house, especially if you're lucky enough to live in a larger than average home. Even if you live in a standard two up, two down place like I do, fast Wi-Fi in every nook and cranny is still very beneficial. Well, the new D-Link cover promises just that, as it uses what's called a mesh Wi-Fi system. D-Link are claiming that their new cover AC2200 will give you complete home coverage all of the time, and we've certainly found that to be true. So the box has been branded beautifully with enough style to really make it stand out if seen in a retail outlet. Now there's enough information on the box to give you a good idea of what you're getting. So setup is relatively painless as well, there's just a lot of waiting around watching blue circles fill up to 100% while it connects to various parts of your home. The unit we were sent, the A2200, came with two units, one sender and one receiver, both with WPS buttons for easy connection to devices without screens, plus security cameras. So to set up, you will need to download the D-Link app onto your Android or iOS device. The app will prompt you to scan the QR code that's provided on a card in the box. Now from here, you follow on-screen instructions for things like setting up a network name and strong password. Now I'd just like to say quickly that I forgot to mention when I was actually in the studio that you have to plug in the main unit, the sender unit, directly into your router using an Ethernet cable. And of course, it does require power as well. I'm sorry I didn't mention this, and let's get back to the review. Now this is where the waiting begins as your existing network hunts and connects to your main device. Now once that's connected, a solid white light will show. Now once your main network is set, you plug in your second receiver unit and follow the on-screen instructions again on your phone to connect the receiver to the actual sender. Now everything is done inside the app and after you've done that the setup is done. Now your phone will be set up on the network and if you then go into any other wireless devices in your home or office you will see the new network appear. And you just connect as you normally would to a wireless network with the new password you've just set up within the D-Link app. Now once your devices are connected they will appear on the app as well. So the app comes with many settings including which devices receive priority connections, a timer on when the internet can be used on this network as well as some child safety features as well. Now an awesome feature and one that I was unaware of until I did some research was its smart steering technology. Now this is basically something that detects which gigahertz band is best for the device and automatically selects that band for you. Now the network features MooMimo as well to ensure the best and strongest connection for your single device as opposed to only being able to receive single data packets at any one time. Now one huge benefit of having a mesh setup like this one in your home is the fact that no matter how many points you have dotted around the home or office, you will never have to switch between networks to receive the best signal unlike my previous system. So here's a few numbers for you. The total network speed of the wireless mesh network is 2200 megabits per second which is shared between the 2 gigahertz bands, 886 megabytes per second on the 5 gigahertz band and the final 300 megabits per second on the 2.4 gigahertz band. Now it features an 802.11ac wave 2 tri-band wireless with 6 internal antennas on each unit. Now tri-band means that there are your usual wireless signals as well as one separate 5 gigahertz band that the two units use to talk to one another. Now previously to installing the D-Link cover mesh network I was using a very basic repeater box that I purchased from eBay for around £10. It worked alright, I can't really say it's bad but you have to check out these numbers that I'll put on screen. Now each speed test was completed three times to give an average speed to keep it as real as possible. I didn't tell my family to stop what they were doing online like watching Netflix in the lounge or gaming in the office. So it's really a no-brainer that speeds would improve across the board. It's a far superior product compared to the Asus repeater that I was using previously. However, the signal that both my phone and laptop received was much better with the D-Link cover mesh network. Now the signal that my phone and laptop received with the Asus repeater, especially upstairs in the bedroom and in the garden, struggled which is why speeds dropped quite significantly. So the D-Link cover was a huge upgrade to my home wireless network, so much so that we've even started streaming movies to the lounge TV. Having a mesh setup means that there's no area of the house that gets left out, meaning everyone in the home or office space should get super fast and spreely broadband. This kit will set you back around £250 on Amazon, but it really depends on what you're doing with your wireless network before investing in a system like this. Are you streaming movies from your NAS drive at the same time as gaming online or do you just use the internet to browse Facebook and buy things from eBay? So thank you very much for checking out our video review of the D-Link Cover Mesh Network. If you enjoyed this video then do click that like button. Please do subscribe to keep up with all of our latest tech and gaming videos and also let us know in the comments below what you think about a mesh network, whether it's something you would use in your home or whether you would stick to something like a wireless router that you get from your 
um, internet service provider and then have a repeater box somewhere else in the home. Let us know how you set up your wireless network and let's have a discussion in the comments. I do want to say one thing as well is thank you very much for everyone that has subscribed to this channel. I will say we've hit a thousand subscribers so that's our first kind of milestone goal complete. The next step is obviously 10,000 subscribers. But I just want to say thank you all for being here. If you're enjoying the content, let us know in the comments below as well. We'd love to hear from you. But thank you very much for watching and we will see you in the next video.